I'm going to start with the Gillette uh, Pro Glide Skin Guard. It's got two lubricating bars. It's supposed to lubricate your skin as you go. I don't like it personally because it keeps you from getting close enough with the razor to get a good shave, but it's good with for people that have sensitive skin. But I'm going to start shave one side of my face with this one. I always run my blades under hot water and then rinse with hot water as I go to help open up my pores as I'm shaving as well. Here we go. I'm going to shave the other half of my face with the Gillette Skin Guard. It's got uh, these just two blades, but it's got two bars to keep you from pressing too close to the skin. It's for people with sensitive skin that gets uh, razor bumps and stuff too easy. I can't stand it. It's, it's a very comfortable shave, but it leaves like a 5 o'clock shadow. But if you don't mind a little 5 o'clock shadow and you have really sensitive skin or maybe even acne, you might give it a whirl. You shave fairly quick with both of these razors because of the guard, but one thing I have found a really good use for, well, I'll tell you when I get done in the total review. Final review, obviously I still have a five o'clock shadow. On both sides of my face, actually. But uh, if you have really sensitive skin, I'd go with the Gillette Skin Guard, but if it's not that sensitive, but you just want a more comfortable uh, shave, I would go with the uh, Shield. But they both suck. Uh, you just can't get a close shave with either of them. One good use for the Skin Guard I found is if haven't been able to shave for a few days and you still want to use a razor and you have pretty long stubble you can take the first pass with this one get rid of most of it and then use your normal razor but uh the winner is definitely the shield in this one but yeah they both suck don't buy them unless you have sensitive skin